Uh, the name of our studio is Tutu Lab, right. and the name of our app is Fudo Kitchen. Uh, what kitchen? Oh, Fudo. Fudo Kitchen, yes. Right. right, tell us about it then. Sure. Uh, Fudo Kitchen is a game for kids, for uh -huh. the iPad. Right. Uh, where you get to run your own bizarre little bakery shop. Now, your customers are pleasantly polite and adorable monsters yeah. who want you to whip up desserty delights for them. Okay. Now, each monster is very opinionated in particular and wants your yummy cake creations to match their taste. Right, okay. Um, now, um, if you get it wrong, you'll see the cake coming right back up. Lovely. <laughs> So the monster will be spitting it out uh -huh. all across the screen. Now, like in real life, the little chef uh, will get to pour the flour on the table. And then you also get to pour some milk. Uh -huh. Obviously, you also need to crack two eggs, right. for instance. And then roll the dough. And so different recipes will require different cooking combinations? Uh, different recipes require different cake shapes and different flavours, right, okay. which we'll get to right at the moment. Sorry, I'm getting ready <laughs> there, sorry. It's so, alright, so we get to choose the mould to, uh, to match the recipe, uh -huh. or not. We, we're going to get it wrong this time. There's going to be a little memory game to turn the oven on. Okay. And once you bake the cake, you open up the oven right in time, not to burn it. Then you get to flavour the cake according to the recipe and the monster's order. Right. And you can you can go madly freestyle with some gruesome sprinkles like cockroaches and ladybirds. Um, afterwards, you get to decorate your cake with some truly wacky items like a UFO or a bomb, because why not? Or an umbrella. Yeah. So this is a true mix and match baking spree. Then you get to feed your monster caringly. And then you get his very expressive Lovely, feedback. Yes. Um, you can also save your culinary creations in a photo book, uh -huh. uh, which also unlocks further items and further monsters and further decorations. Um, now, essentially, with Fudo Kitchen, we just wanted to create a game that teaches kids to make nice things for someone and yeah. teaches you empathy. Um, now, the game also boasts uh, no text, no language, and no tutorials at all. Oh, that's so, cool. it's, we make sure that it's instantly accessible to everyone who doesn't even know any language at all yet. Right. Yeah. Um, You'll see that the illustrations are insanely detailed. It's yeah. full of Easter eggs and little surprises that you'll discover along the yeah, way. Yeah, I saw things like the mice under the table yes. and that kind of thing, right, yeah. Um, and furthermore, um, the illustrations are this grumpy style uh, to just ensure that it's somewhere between gruesome and funny because we're so tired of these cute kids oh, apps on the yeah. app stores. Yeah, sure. Like, uh, about princesses, uh, you know, get rid of it and bring on the nasty, icky stuff that yeah. kids really love. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, now so the, how do you, uh, you monetize the game? Um, it's going to cost two ninety nine or one ninety nine dollars. We're not sure yet. Yeah. The release date is the fifteenth of May on the App Store. Oh, okay. And. Like I said, in our two girls studio, we just wanted to put out something out there that we really love and have nurtured ourselves. Yeah, so this is just you two doing just all this? Just us two. Yeah, that's um, really nice. The look of it is wicked. Yes, thank you. And so we really do hope that this love shows through in this marvellous, monstrous baking goodness. <laughs>